Hello, my name is Bradford Ben. I am Director of Application Engineering for Crown International. Over the next few minutes, I'm just going to go through an iTech HD feature for you. Before we get started, I want to go through a few conventions. The first is, is that when I click on something, you will see a red circle like that. If I right click on something, you will see a blue circle like that. And also just for reference, these video captures were made using System Architect 1.9. In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at the new Level Max feature in the iTech HD. The Level Max feature is the next generation of the limiter available in the iTech. The reason we call this Level Max is that we have worked with JBL Professional to design output limiting that allow you to drive the output transducers or speakers to their maximum while still remaining in a safe working area. So it's louder, longer, safer. It's a very powerful feature. We've also worked very hard to make this feature very easy to use. In the typical use, you simply come in and set your threshold voltage, which you can get off of this manufacturer's cut sheet, its thermal response time, and its thermal voltage. And from here, what I'll do is you'll actually calculate the safe working information based on the values. The fact that all you have to do is set these three parameters to be able to keep your speaker playing louder or longer safer becomes very powerful. Now, if you want to go in and adjust more settings, you can come into the advanced page and now you have both your peak voltage as well as your release times that you can set. You still have the thermal response time and thermal voltage. Thermal response time is basically a way of measuring how long it takes the driver to heat up and what the voltage is to require it to start to heat up. And then the peak and RMS values as you can see those come from the manufacturer's cut sheet. If in doubt please call your speaker manufacturer and they'll be able to assist you with getting this information. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Please feel free to check back and look for more tutorials.